What's going on, everybody? This is Al from Instantly 06 Revival. And in the last video, we had a heartbreaking loss against Wisconsin. I was down a couple scores late, was able to come back, make something out of it, but just couldn't prevail in the end. I had two big blunders in that game, that goofy interception at the goal line where I hit the wrong button. And then last play of the game, I just didn't go in the end zone like I was supposed to. I picked the wrong play. Just a, a bad ending. So hopefully I can redeem myself sometime this season with an upset win somewhere else. Well, today we're going to take on Illinois. This is a big game for us. Hopefully we can get our first conference win of the season. Just looking at the stats here, Illinois is having a good season. They got a little more talent than we do. Seems like they're halfway decent everywhere. Nothing exceptional, but their offense as a whole is not all that bad. Passing the ball, we're right up there, third in the country, uh, 26 overall on offense. Before we play them, let's go through our normal routine. Let's go to recruiting. Looks like I got 10 points remaining. I guess the kid that I, I put 10 points in, that defensive tackle, it was just too late, this kid right here. So no big deal. I went down for this guy right here out of Indiana, the local kid. I wonder if it's because he took a visit to Tennessee and, you know, and he doesn't like one of my pitches, so that doesn't help. This guard, I don't think I have a chance. I've been stuck at fifth for the longest time. I just can't see me working out for him. So I'm going to take points off of him. This corner, I'm still at the top of his list. So I'm definitely going to put five here. I, I still think I have a chance right here just because, like I said, I think Tennessee moved up just because of, of an, a visit or of some sort. So I'm not going to give up on him yet. Wide receiver, he's ready to take a visit. Let's see, priority list. Uh, let's just do location for now. Ohio State and Georgia. I wonder if he's really if he really cares about just the prestige. And I can't promote prestige because I don't have it yet. So we'll just do location for now. I still think we may be able to get a commitment even if we lose today. So let's do 20 here. Middle linebacker. Negative. It's just the prestige. But I'm still at the top of his list. Let's do 20 here. And middle linebacker. We're still good here. For second, this quarterback, he still, I think he really wanted to come here, but his arm just isn't good enough for what we're trying to do. So we're going to go 20, 20, 20, 20, 20 across the board and drop this tackle. I just don't think I have a chance of getting him, or uh, the guard. I think that's out of reach. I think he's going to Notre Dame. So I think we're all good there. Let's go ahead and play Illinois. Should be a tough one. The key here is we could just try to get that commitment from that local receiver. Be our first commitment of the dynasty. Hopefully we play well today. It's been a long, long time since i played Illinois, so I'm not sure exactly what they run. I think they're a spread team. This is uh, Ron Zuck's first season at Illinois. I'm just kind of going back to like, they're a big 2007 year where they had, like, a really good season. Had a good quarterback, a good receiver. Had that running back that was pretty good, too. They got a couple tackles hurt. Of course, we got a couple pseudo linemen ourselves. One's definitely a lineman. That one's a tight end. McFarland's already got 1,500 yards on the season through four games. That's pretty good. So he's well on pace to get... Uh, close to 4,500. Looks like they are going to get the ball first. There is no wind whatsoever. Let's check out their roster. Their quarterback can't run. That's good to know. Pierre Thomas, I'm guessing they're going to give him the ball quite a bit. They've got a very good fullback and a good wide receiver, so they may be pretty balanced. According to their stats, they were. So we'll just see which 
route they take, my guess they'll go right down the middle depending on how well their offense goes tonight. 80, 76, 88, 80, and right tackles out, but the backup's not bad. 82, 76. I think they run a 4-3. They need to put this guy up here, the number two spot. I don't know why they don't have that switched up. 76, 78, 76, 80, 78. They got a little more talent than I do. They got a very good strong safety. Kickers, 70 and a 90 at a punter. All right. Let's get this show on the road. See if we can get our first conference win of the season. Looks like a perfect kick. He may take it out, though. Mendenhall fields it in the end zone. Rashawn Mendenhall. I think that's him. Going too wide, as usual. We'll go nickel for the bigger sets, just because we don't have the talent at linebacker this year. When he's on the field, as he is right now, defenses really have to tailor their game plan for him. He's a heck of a player, and I really believe that he could have a good game today. Good stop in the backfield. We'll take it. Second and 12. Going three wide. Let's do quarters out of nickel. That was a good pickup. Almost got the first. I'm glad I moved over there. Now it's third and one. They're going dime. Let's just do a dog gold. I'm guessing they'll probably run it here. I'm going to scoot up. I'm pretty sure that, yeah. That's why I was a little worried about. He was going to run to the right. That was a smart play call. Okay, let's go back to one high. We're going supposedly too wide, or two tight ends. Ooh, man, almost a completion. That would have been a big play for them. Going four wide. I want to go back. Uh, let's do quarters out of dime. It's second down and ten to go. Ball on the 35. They'll bring in their dime package. Watch out for a halfback direct. Or... Ooh, good stop there in the open field. Now it's third and long. Let's go. Let's do cloud. The defense will try to stop this third down as they were unsuccessful the first time on this drive. See if we can get a good stop here. Let's see if I can try to get to the quarterback if possible. Back foot. Big play. Go, Killian. Oh, big play. He threw it off his back foot. I guess he was feeling the pressure. Okay. Let's do twin halfbacks. Twin halfbacks. Halfback slots. Tight end slot. Halfback slot. Let's do tight end slot. And I'm about to run out of time. Dang it. Let's just call a timeout. <laughs> That's a long, been a long time since I've done that. Uh, thank the Lord it's just the first half. I should have done all those like throughout the game and not at once. All right, they're going zone. I like to go play action off a turnover. I may just bounce this to Bailey for now. Ooh, good defense. Let's go halfback streak. They're going zone, so I'll probably just bounce this to Gilmore. Go, Gilmore. Pick up the first, I think. He did. He got it. Good deal. Let's go back here. Let's just run a screen. They're going man, so I need to watch out. He's coming up. Good blocking everywhere. 
Don't do anything crazy with a juke. Just pick up the first. I got twin halfbacks here. Let's do wide receiver in. They're going zone. So I'll probably just bounce this to Sexton. High snap. High throw, high snap. Just wasn't good timing on any of that. Let's go. Let's do a tight end post. Or right. going man, so this will more than likely go to Gilmore. Just give it to your best player. They're coming, bringing both safeties, but good defense. I think I threw a little that one a little too late. Third and seven. Let's go. They're always making plays to disrupt the passing game. Let's do corner strike. Or going man. This will go to either Bailey or Gilmore. They're bringing both safeties. Just make a play, Gilmore. Nice. Touchdown. One-on-one -on -one situation. As long as the pass was accurate, it should be a touchdown, which it was. Well, we wasted a timeout, but we still got the touchdown. No big deal. So that's a good lesson. If you have an offense that's heavily reliant on sub packages like this one is, at least for this year. Do those periodically throughout the game, like when you need that formation. Change it then and not all at the same time. Unless you're really quick with them. And that time I was just really taking my time. So I lost the timeout out of that. But hopefully that won't hurt me. I'm going to take a knee, so that was a good kick. Five wide. Let's do quarters at a dime. That's my strength of my defense, my dime package. Oh, my gosh, I overshot it. <laughs> I was right there, and I completely overshot it. Oh, my gosh. But the offensive line protected just long enough for him to find his target. And when you combine the two, Ooh, I think I went nickel instead of dime bear. I just now noticed that. We're fighting a line out. Set up in the gun. Good stop. Hit him in the backfield. That should be second and 11. They're going supposedly three wide, so we'll just do quarters for now. Out of nickel. Oh, they're, I'm going to have a lot of action happen on my side of the field. That was a bad, that's a good catch. Oh, incomplete. I was way off on that one. I was not in good position. But it's third and long. That's what we want, so we're going to go to Cloud. See if we can... Oh, so close. I was right at his feet. Oh, my gosh. That's a good play. Just my front four couldn't get to him. Let's go with Crash Gold out of dime. Ooh, almost intercepted by... Our impact linebacker, Killian, going dime again, so let's just do quarters. Throw a little zone at him. Cramp, I was right there. <laughs> just a bad angle on my part. Uh, open field tackling is not my strength. I'm like 50-50 on those. All right, let's do one high. I'd rather have my better safety defend him than my bad safety. Ooh, spin move. Pick up eight yards. Halfback direct. Let's do a monster green. We're about to run out of room anyways, so. Crap. 
Ooh, I, it was super close. And I got a guy hurt, my defensive end. Oh, I don't need anybody injured. First and 10, they got it. Just do one high, I guess. Halfback draw. Pick up a couple yards. Pick up one. Let's do quarters. Seven weeks. Wow. Injuries are the death of me this year. Do I have any talent behind him? No, I don't. My third best defensive end is behind him. Seven weeks. Tosh. Of what? There's nothing you can do about it. I think we're running quarters, and I'm gonna shade over. Ooh, okay. Third and long. Let's let's do something weird. Let's do a monster three with some weird blitzing from different places. Oh my gosh, I was right there. We still got the stop, so maybe we can hold him to a field goal. Ah, seven weeks. All three of my injuries have been pretty significant, like long-term, multi-month type of injuries. Well, for all the blunders we had on that drive, hold him to a field goal was a, a good win right there. So now let's get back on offense and try to put up some points. The quarter is about over. Ooh, I'm going to have to take this one out. Just don't fumble it. Let's just do something real simple. Let's just do a halfback out. We're going zone, so I'll probably just bounce this to Washington. Just to play it safe. I have no need to go over the middle right now. Pick up seven or yard, seven or eight, maybe. Yeah, and I tell you what, that defense has got to adjust their coverage a little bit. They can't continue to let this happen. Let's go. Trying to think of some plays. I just haven't ran in a while. Second and two coming up. Got a lot of options. Okay, we're going zone here, so let's just go to Bailey. Indiana lines up with three receivers. McFarland drops back to pass. Crap, that's just a bad throw. Another high one. Third and two. Let's do something. Let's do slot seams. We're going man, so I'm hoping I can just bounce this to Gilmore across the middle. Either that or Bailey's going to get over the top. We're going one high. Ooh, bad throw. He had a real, really reach for that one. Let's just do a screen. They're going man here. He's coming up. Bad throw. Or it was a high snap is what it was. And Bailey's hurt. <laughs> Injuries. I don't know what to do about him. It's killer. Gonna we'll have to get away from the four wide sets now. Let's do tight end corner. Or going man, so I'll probably just bounce this to Gilmore. I don't think I'll have enough time to give to Washington. Gray throw. Ooh, man, what a play. Keep giving it to Gilmore. He's feeling it right now. Okay, uh, I'm going to go here. I'm going to do wide receiver under. They're going man. Bailey's coming back. That's good. So this either go to Turner. Mm. Oh, this is going over top. Make a play, Kleinschmidt. That's a tough throw. Just a tough throw. A little high. Second and ten. Let's go here. Let's do P.A. Reed. They're going man 4-3. Spreading that. I guess I have no choice but to throw it. They're going one high. Ooh, bad throw. 
That was good defense, actually. Third and ten. Let's make this two-down territory. Ah, they're going zone here. Let's pick up the first. Now I'm on the 15-yard line. Let me think. Uh, let's do fullback seam. We're going man, so this more than likely will go to Gilmore. Just depending on we're going one high. Uh, oh, just not enough. Or too much, I guess. Second and ten. Let's just do curls. We're going dime man. Let's see who's defending Washington. Indiana in a four-wide set fires it quickly. Complete tries to juke. That's good coverage. They had a couple of their man beaters on the right. Or man defenders on the right just stay in containment. Third and seven. Uh, I'm still going to go to Gilmore here, and this may be two down territory. Or we could just pick up the touchdown, Gilmore. He went a lot higher than what I expected. I was expecting on him to go five yards, but he went a little deeper on his route. We'll take it. 14 to 3. Well, 13 to 3. You got to knock on wood. We've got to get the extra point. Not the best kick, but he's going to squeeze in. Let's get back on defense. I'm all for holding them the field goals. They can do that all they want as long as I keep scoring touchdowns. My kicker is playing pretty well tonight so far. He's going to return this one. Ooh, good open field tackle. Two wide. Uh, let's just do one high at a nickel. I think it's time to give to their best player, the running back. <laughs> that should be picked off. Come on now. You got to pick those off. Well, let's do quarters. Switch it up. Oh, good open field tackle by Killian. Man, he's been stud for me all year. Third and four. Uh, let's do Clout. I think they're going to throw. I'm just going to take the chance that they will. And my defensive tackle got annihilated there. Oh, that should have been intercepted. Oh, that's two chances for picks. No problem, though. We still got the fourth down, so they're going to punt it. Plenty of time to score maybe at least a couple touchdowns if I can get the ball back right before half. That's good coverage. I want to go gun spread. I want to do P8 read. We're going zone dime. So this will either go to Bailey or Washington. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Can he get there? I think he'll get caught. He's going to get caught. Whew, good play. We'll take it. Okay. Why haven't I ran much tonight? I'm, ooh, wide receiver in. We could do that again. We could do the left-handed version of it. Uh, let's do tight end corner. We haven't ran that yet. They're going zone. So this will just go to Washington unless it's wide open across the middle for Kleinsman. I'm not going to have enough room. Yeah, I may have enough time. There we go. That's a good play. First down. I had just enough time to get Clinchman open across the middle. I got enough space to run this play. Let's do slot corner. We're going zone. So this will more than likely go to Gilmore, maybe Washington. 
This impact receiver is looking to make a play. He's in the zone. Comes across the middle. Make a play. <laughs> Touchdown, Washington. So McFarland's already broken the all-time season touchdown passing record with 18, which seems extremely low, which means I guess Indiana's never had any passing-oriented offense in their history. I mean, 18 is low. So I broke it in the fifth game, which is good. If he stays healthy, I could probably get around 40 touchdowns. So back to that play, the middle was wide open. They were blitzing, so I went to my center beater, which was Washington, just passed to him, and then he took the rest of it to the house, breaking tackles. That play is ideal for my type, for the team this year. Against zone, Washington and Gilmore were both available. All right, let's go dog gold. We're going to go one high. I don't want my bad safety on there. Ooh, good play. A little slant route. Call the timeouts. Let's do quarters. Got a lot of action on, on my side of the field. Ooh, I was right there. I saw him coming across. Uh, let's just stay quarters for now. It's first and ten. Ball on the 34. They come out in a nickel. They'll throw on first down. Ooh, good catch. I thought that was going to be intercepted. Let's stick with quarters. I'm okay with that. He's throwing some pretty risky throws right now. Make a play. Ooh, good play. Swatted it down. Now it's third and two. They may, yeah, I think they're going to run it here. So let's just do a, a one high at a nickel again. Just don't have the talent at linebacker. Let's get everybody up. Play action. Now, are they going to count that as a first? They're not going to. I'm going to call timeout. And they're going to punt it. Fourth and inches. I thought they were going to call first down on that one. So, it looks like that timeout I wasted at the beginning of the game is not going to really affect me unless I can't get down the field here. We'll just see what happens. Nope, 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 nope. All right. I got 43 seconds. I need to move down the field somewhat. Let's go back to tight end post. We're going man, so I'll probably just give this to Gilmore. Going one high. Oh, what a throw. Got me out of bounds. First and ten, so I guess that's the ideal play call there. Halfback circle, but the clock is running. They're going man. Got to hurry it up. Both safeties coming up. This is going to clinchman. Make a play. Nice. We'll take it. Shave off a couple seconds there. Big play. Big, big play. That corner completely whiffed on that one, whatever he was doing. I don't know. They got bad corners. It's showing. Passing attack is nice and fluid tonight. Firing on all cylinders. I think every main offensive weapon has touched the ball. Except maybe Taylor, my other halfback. I'm trying to think. Yeah, I think everybody else has got to touch the ball at least once. Ooh, not a very good kick. Good stop, though. 18 seconds. I'm hoping they'll just want to run it. Ooh, going. Let's just do too high, man. They may try to go deep with this. Sack. 
Just let the play go, and that's my backup, Thomas. Good for him. Going four wide, too high man. If they're smart, they'll just let the clock run out. All right. As good as a first half as we can ask for. Let's check out the stats real quick at halftime. Individual, 16-21, 263 yards, four touchdowns already. They're just killing it. Rushing, of course, we don't run the ball much. Don't really have to. Um, Gilmore, Washington, Bailey, Kleinschmidt, Sexton. And once you add in Taylor, I usually have six guys touch the ball at one point or another. So that's looking about right. And we get the ball started in the second half. And the teams are lined up to start the second half. Kicks it deep. That's a good kick, but that's going to our best player. Fields it in the end zone. Yeah. Ooh. Well, Just don't throw a blitz. You know okay. You Let me think. What haven't we called? Let's do. Oh, uh, where's that? Yeah, slot cross. They're going man. So I probably will give this to Sexton unless both safeties come up. Nope, they're going one high. What a throw. Oh, Sexton with a play. Man, that was a dart. Great play all around. Now let's stay in this four. No, let's go here. I want to go. Let's do a halfback screen. We haven't called that today. We're going zone. And what I want to do is move over Washington. This gives me a chance to give it to Taylor. That'll distract that corner over there. Bad throw, but eh, not a actually a pretty decent throw. So good first down. Let's go back to P. Reed. We're going zone dime. So this either go to Bailey or Washington. Pick up seven-ish. Eight yards. Let's go here. Let's run. Let's do slot corner. We're going man. Ball on the 30. I'll probably, it just depends on who's defending Taylor. Let's motion, yeah, let's do it. I was off my back foot. I was feeling the heat on the left side, so it ended up being a good play, but. Let's do, uh, where's an edge? I haven't called it today. Let's do clear out. We're going zone. Let's just see. What they decide to throw at me here. Nope, I've, nothing was open there. I was not feeling it there. Let's go. Uh, I'll tell you what, we can run the double running back option. We haven't ran a, haven't done one run play tonight. Well, I think we've done the one. Let's do this one. Have both of them kind of going here. And they push him out. The handback option good for seven. Pick up eight, seven. I'm going to go back to slot corner. And we take a quick We're going zone. So again, this will go to Washington or Gilmore. When performance just depending on the coverage. Easy first down. That's why I called it. That's just an easy three yards against the zone, and of course you got a great man beater with that flat route. I want to go here, and I want to go do curls at a weak normal. They're going man. I'm hoping I could just dump this to Washington. If not, this will go to Gilmore, just depending on who's defending Washington. I think he's got enough speed to keep up with him. That's going out of bounds, though. Still pick up some good gains. Let's do a screen. We're going man. Interesting. Let's 
see if they can take this one in for six. God. Negative yardage. Like and Kleinschmidt's hurt. Another guy hurt. What in the world? I don't know what to do about that. Uh, I'm on the nine. Let's go. I have it on my mind, so let's go fullback. Seam. No, let's go here. We'll do deep comebacks. We're going man. So this will go to Gilmore. He's coming up, so that's one high. Oh, you got to catch that. Gilmore was double teamed, so I had to go to my other comeback. Oh, let's just go for a field goal. Let's pick up the points. Please, clients, but don't be hurt. I'm running out of formations to use. Terrible kick. Perfect kick. Never mind. <laughs> I thought I shanked it left. Oh, gosh. Kleinschmidt, please be healthy. I have no talent with receiver as is outside of Gilmore and you. That's going in the end zone for a touchback. So we're up four touchdowns. Let's do one high. We'll return. Halfback draw. Uh-oh, here he comes. Oh, gosh, I knew I would screw that up. I knew it, I knew it. Dang it, dang it. <laughs> Open field tackling. Oh, it's a struggle. I completely botched it. Gosh. My bad. Again, I'm 50-50 on those. It's either a complete whiff or I can get the tackle. Can't believe they scored a huge play on a draw from the gun, no less, which is so hard to do. But that's what happens. we got bad tackling. So let's get back on offense, I guess. Let's see if Thick Pin can do something here. Little thick pin. Oh man, that little nudge. Let's go. Let's do wide receiver in. They're going zone, so this will just go to Washington. Terrible throw. I don't know what that was. Let's do curls. They are bringing, hmm. He's coming up. I'm going to have Gilmore go deep. That's intercepted. Ooh. I knew both safeties were coming up, so I went that. Went to my best player. I had to throw it pretty quick. All right, they're going zone here. This is going to be a tough throw. Oh, overthrown. The middle was wide open. Just a bad throw. I'm going to punt it. Just play it safe. Pretty good kick. He's got time to do something with it. McPherson takes it to 12. Get a stop. Somebody stop him. There we go. This is where I look for the defense to clamp down after some sloppy. Well, the third quarter hasn't been all that great so far. Good play. Just one on one coverage. That's just a good throw. Uh, let's do quarters at a dime. It's first and ten. Ball on the 43. The Illini set up in the gun. I don't know what that other corner is doing. Good stop. I'm glad he was there. Well, that was Killian. Already got nine tackles on the night. Just a beast. Let's go back to quarters. We'll do that nickel this time. They come out of the nickel. Nickel defense. Thomas gets the call. 
Good stop. Open field tackle. Can't go wrong with Killian there. Okay. Let's do Cloud. See if we can get a stop. I'd love to find a way to get after this quarterback. Ooh. Make a play, somebody. Come on. There we go. Fumble! Somebody pick it up! Okay, crisis averted. We're going to get the ball back here. We'll have to figure some stuff out here on offense. Last drive wasn't too good. It's away and it's a booming punt. Good blocking on the right, I think, except for that one Number kid. I don't know. Just don't fumble it. So the offense takes over, and the last time they had the ball. I want to go back. Kleinspit is still not out there. He said he's supposed to return. Unless I'm looking at it wrong. Let's do this. Let's go back to here. All right, they're going man here, so this will be interesting. This is either going to go to Taylor or Washington. McFarland lines up in the shotgun. They'll throw on first down. That's what I was wanting right there. That's good coverage, though. He was right there, but Washington had just enough speed. It's a great play. Oh, uh, let's do wide receiver middle. They're going man. Clashman, he's 81. That's right. They're going man, so I got a lot of options here. They're doing too high. Good throw. Bailey was wide open, too. Just don't fumble it. Don't fumble it. Good first down. Let's do tight end corner. They're going zone, so this will go to Clinchman. Just depending on what those linebackers do. The middle was open a little bit, so I waited an extra second. Picked up five yards. We'll stay here. Let's do fullback seam. I don't think I'm going to have enough time. Now, we're just going to let the clock run. We'll go to the fourth quarter. We're up three scores. As long as we don't do anything crazy, we should win. Let's go back to fullback seam. They're going man here, so this will either go to Taylor or Gilmore. I'm going to motion him Indiana out. Lines up in a shotgun set. He's defending him, so I'm not going to go to him. Throw Bad throw. Oh, just a little too far. And that one will go down as an it's too bad Third and five. Super Let's let our two best players decide this. We'll either go to Washington or Gilmore. They're going man, so I'm going to go to Gilmore here. Just make a good, clean throw, McFarlane. We can pick up the first. There we go. Now, let's run smash. I haven't ran this any today. I'm going to flip it. At least the spread version. They're going zone, so I'm going to just bounce this to Gilmore, which is square. There's not a whole lot there. That's really good coverage. I think they went cover two zone max on that one. And that's because the defense was just waiting on it, and they attacked. Well, let's go. Somebody do, else do, down do, do. Uh, Let's do wide receiver under again. They're going zone, so this will either go to Gilmore or Washington, which is a pattern with this offense this year. I saw a little bit of a hole in them across the middle, so I went to Gilmore there. Third and two. Let's just stay in this formation and go curls. I have it on my mind, so we'll run it. They're going man here, dime. I'm hoping I can just bounce this to Washington. Yeah, wide open. Free safety was defending him. He didn't have a chance. He was too far away. Now, I want to go back to this smash play. Out of trips over. We're going man. So, I'll probably just give this to Washington. Hopefully, he can get some decent separation here. Just have to throw it hard. Oh, and a touchdown. Perfect throw. That's the only reason why that play worked. It's just a perfect throw. That was great coverage. Tight spiral. So they'll sneak in for a touchdown. All right. 
I think that sealed it for us. So hopefully we'll get our big commitment. Wide receiver, local product. He'll be extra special to us just because he was the first to commit to this up and coming program. Now, I think the next two or three games is where it gets real interesting. <laughs> the rosters go up in talent just a little bit. I don't remember who we play next. Ohio State, maybe? I just don't remember. We'll check it at the end of the video. At the end of this game, let's just do cores. I think we're going to start throwing from here on out. So let's just help him out here. Ooh, terrible throw. McFarland's having a perfect game, more or less. We'll just stay in quarters for now. Second and ten. Ball on the twenty-yard line. Number sixteen with three wide receivers. I hate when my other. Ooh, good throw. Ooh, no bad throw. I figured that two they'd go to. That was one-on-one -on -one situation. All right, let's go to Cloud. Third and ten. Bad throw. And that, one's that was real close. Actually, a decent throw, but just a little too much. We're going to get the ball back, and you know what we're going to do. We're going to keep slinging it. McFarland's already got over 400 yards. It's possible he may get 500, but we'll just see what happens. Maybe he could pick up around 50 on this drive. I'm seeing some decent blocking. No, oh, maybe not. Oh, look at this. Ooh. They move the ball very effectively. Okay, let's go. Do, 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 do. Let's do P. Reed. I may run it here. It's just depending on how they're going to shift. They're going man. I think I'm not going to throw it. Let's just give this to Sexton. Ooh, bad throw. No doubt. Uh, let's go. But give me a break. Yeah, let's go back to slot corner. They're going zone on this again. This will go to Washington. Gilmore. Good open field tackle. He picked up five-ish, maybe? Yeah, picked up five. Let's do tight end corner. Yeah, they're going zone, so we'll just see what happens here. This will go to Washington or Clinchman. Get up the first down. Whew. We'll break this play down. We're going zone. I have a flat uh, in Washington over to the left, so he's my number one. But unless that middle comes open, right in this area right here, as you can tell, it is wide open. So I had enough time to throw it ooh, to give it to my slant or my dig coming through to pick up the first down. Good play. Now, I want to uh, do a halfback screen. It's on my mind, so let's just run it. Where's that? We'll do the trips version. We're going zone. 4-3. This should be interesting. I hope they blitz hard. Give him time to... Uh, oh, just a bad throw. He just, he got bogged down right there. I'll tell you what, these guys play sideline to sideline and have great instincts. They knew exactly. Let's go back to wide receiver middle. This is a good universal play. They're going man. He's doing that, so this will go to either Turner or Gilmore. Let's give it to Gilmore, might as well. I had plenty of time to throw. They just didn't make I'm the on the eight-yard line. Right. Let's go. Uh, I don't know what to call. Let's do a basic run play. Let's do an off-tackle out of this formation. They're going man, but they're going nickel. They got a hanging corner over there, so this may not work. And they're shifting hard. Yeah, that's just a... 
nowhere to be found there. Uh, That's a great example of quickness by the defensive line. It's too tight in corner. They're going man, so if they bring both safeties, I'm going to try to sneak at the Sexton. Otherwise, this will go to Gilmore. Make a play, Sexton. Oh, just too tall. Too high for him. Okay, 11 yards. I need 11. I need 11. Uh, let's go. Haven't ran this play yet today. Let's do a double cross. This gives Kleinschmidt and Gilmore the ability to make the play. We're going man, so let's just see what these safeties do. We're going one high. Ooh. Oh, that's Turner. Kleinschmidt must be out for whatever reason. It's fourth and one on the one. Let's see if we can just run the ball. Let's do a toss. They're going zone. Pick up the touchdown. Okay, I think that seals it. Good blocking everywhere. Offensively, it's been pretty flawless. As long as I don't make goofy mistakes, you know, incorrect button presses and calling the right plays at the right time, the offense can really click, as you've seen in these first five games already with limited talent. The air raid is a lot of fun, and it, it could definitely work. And the owl raid, which was my first book, is just a portion of what this offense is. Uh-oh. Walking back. Over almost 470 yards of offense. Not bad. Let's do quarters at a nickel for now. McFarlane had five touchdowns, but he didn't get his 500 yards, but that's okay. Not a big deal. They're down big, so I guess that's why they're going to give the backup a shot. They'll throw on first down. He's looking. Ooh, almost intercepted. Bounced off about three people. Uh, let's do a zone blitz. We haven't ran any of that this year. I kind of forgot we had this, to be honest. I've been running just a ton of quarters. and Man, one high. I forgot that these quarterbacks can't run the ball. Good play. Wow, that was a good catch. Perfect timing everywhere. That's how you could beat cover two. Another way is just a go route on the short side. Well, just between the corner and the safety. That's definitely a way to do it. He had to throw it as soon as he snapped the ball. Ooh, almost intercepted. Oh, let's go back to that play again. Let's do monster two. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 32-yard line. Illinois comes out with an eye formation. That's a good play call. Good open field tackle, though. Wasn't expecting a basic run right there. Let's just do a one high. Don't think it matters at this point. Let's bring everybody up. Incomplete, fourth and four. I'm sermon they'll go for it, five wide. We'll just do two high, man. I'm not sure what they'll do, to be honest. I can see him running it. Pump up all 30,000 people that are there. <laughs> I don't think it's a big crowd. It won't be for a couple seasons. Good play. I got 34 seconds, so how about we try to score? As long as nobody gets injured. Oh, here, I want to go back to that smash. We'll do it as spread. We're going man, so I got a few options here. He's defending him. Going one high. Good throw. Right where needed to be. Wow, great throw. Come on, come on. McFarlane may break his own record. Okay, they're going zone. I'm just going half-back circle. 
This kid is dialed in. He dropped back. Look. Bad throw. Man, he had to call timeout. I don't know why I'm doing this, but I just want to keep throwing. Let's go. Uh, fullback seam. I'm doing that just so I can try to give the gill more. I want a motion. Taylor, just in case. We're going one high. Bad throw. Nowhere close. Third and three. Well, sometimes you take a chance and throw it with Let's do curls. We're going man. I have sex to go deep just in case. Hmm. Good play. I'm going to just call a timeout. Fourth and two. We'll just go for it. Corner strike. I could go for a Hail Mary here, but I actually think I got a better chance by running this play. Just depending on the blitzing. Indiana sets up with four receivers. Looking. Comes across the middle. Good play there. We'll call another time. At, ooh, end of the game. Okay. Well, I hope that was fun for you as it was for me. We'll check out the stats before we leave. And that's, pretty much good. that's a nice little smack in the face to Illinois. Hopefully that's a... Uh, a game or a streak for a long time running against them. Let's go to stats. Over 500 yards of offense. When everything's really going, that's when you know you've done right. You get 500. 40 of 54. No interceptions. That's what we want it. Almost 500 yards. Seven yards off. Running the ball. Again, we don't have to do it much. Gilmore and Washington are going to just lead the whole thing for the rest of the season. They have to stay healthy in order for us to achieve some of our goals this year. Kleinschmidt, Bailey, Sexton, Turners, Taylor. Yeah. Seven guys got to touch it. Good deal. That's what I like to see. And that's it. Now stick around. Let's see if we can get that commitment. Surely we will. I mean, when you got an impact, a big time wide receiver coming in. And watching this team throw up almost 500 yards of passing yards. I mean, come on. Surely he'll commit. So let's simulate this. And then we'll find out who we play next. Again, I, I forgot who we do play, but I'm sure it's somebody pretty tough. Form one, wasn't really expecting that. I didn't, I, I didn't know what to expect, to be honest. I mean, but the air raid offense is doing its deed. Defense actually played pretty good in that game. If it wasn't for a couple goof, goofy mistakes against Wisconsin at Iowa. See, Iowa, and I didn't get that commitment. Oh, my gosh, he didn't commit. Uh, I guess he didn't like location. That's probably what it was. Uh, Indiana Hoosiers against Iowa next week. Two and four. They must have having a terrible year. But look at their talent. I mean, they're just loaded down. So that's going to be tough. But let's check recruiting real quick and see why he didn't commit. He's probably a soft verbal. He'll commit eventually. But I'm guessing we have to just be patient because he's going to take other visits. I have a humongous lead. Surely I can get this kid. I really want him. He's got the speed. He's got the hands. Ron Bush, Jasper, Indiana, come on. Be a Hoosier. Okay. Come on back. We'll take on two and four Iowa. I mean, who would have thunk it? I'm hoping that I hate to say this, but if they have injuries, that's really going to help us. So come on back. We'll take on the Hawkeyes, and I'll talk to you later.